Okay, in this video, following on from what we have seen in the previous videos, we're now ready to introduce the binomial distribution. So, the binomial distribution. Okay, now um, we say that if we've got n possibilities, so n trials, and x successes, so in the previous video I showed you, I talked to you about um, rolling a die nine times, so there will be nine trials, and I wanted the probability of it getting exactly two sixes, so I'd have two successes. Okay, I would count that as a success when the six appeared. Then the probability of x being equal to x, okay, and I'll explain that momentarily, will be n x, so out of n possibilities I want x number of successes, times by the probability of success um, to the power of x times by the probability of 1 minus p to the n minus x. Okay, so this um, is saying, as referring to the previous example, I had out of 9 uh, trials, I wanted two sixes to appear. Okay, that was the number of combinations. Then I was looking at the actual probability of one possibility, which was one sixth to the power of two, because I wanted the one the six to come up twice. And then I had five sixths, one take away one sixth, to the power of um, seven, which was nine take away two. Okay, so this is the probability of something appearing, okay, of x being equal to x for a particular value. And we say that this capital X, we're looking at this x to be binomially distributed. So this uh, little twiddle means x is binomially distributed with a number of trials n, comma, probability p. Okay? So that's how we define a binomial distribution. And this is how we can calculate specific values from it. So in the next video, I'm going to show you how this works. Okay? So it may look quite complicated at the moment, but it will come clear in the next video.